Creating a fighter aircraft is one of the most demanding feats in engineering. From the initial concept to the final design, the road is filled with challenges. Many aircraft that showed great promise never made it to widespread service. Today, we're looking at 10 of the most intriguing cancelled US fighter aircraft. Some were innovative, others just had bad luck, but all of them are fascinating pieces of aviation history. Number 10. Grumman XF 5 F 1 Skyrocket. In the 1940s, twin engine carrier fighters were practically unheard of, yet Grumman dared to push the envelope with the XF 5 F 1 Skyrocket. This advanced twin engine fighter demonstrated impressive performance during trials in 1941. It even outclimbed the XF 4U Corsair in a test, leaving test pilots amazed. Its opposite rotating propellers eliminated torque making it a dream to fly for carrier pilots. Despite its excellence, the Skyrocket never saw widespread service, leaving it as an impressive, what could have been. Number 9. McDonnell XP-67, Moonbat. The XP-67, known as the Moonbat, had a futuristic design that promised to revolutionize aviation. Its unique blended wing body design minimized drag and maximized lift, making it look like a flying stingray. Unfortunately, the Moonbat was plagued by issues. It had poor handling, inadequate power, and a crash during testing sealed its fate. However, its design concepts would later influence successful aircraft like the State Route 71 Blackbird. Number 8. Northrop F-18L The land-based version of the F-A-18 Hornet, the F-18L, boasted a lighter and more agile frame than its carrier-based counterpart. With reduced weight, it offered better range, maneuverability, and performance overall. It even had a superior missile loadout compared to other fighters of its time. Despite its advantages, the F-18L never saw production as customers preferred the more established F-A-18A. Number 7. Curtis Wright XF-87 Blackhawk. Curtis Wright, once a giant in the aircraft industry, saw its decline marked by the failure of the XF-87 Blackhawk. Despite being a decent jet fighter, it couldn't compete with other designs like the F-89 Scorpion. The Black Hawk marked the end of an era for Curtis Wright, which struggled to keep up with the rapid advancements in jet technology post-World War II. Number 6. Curtis Wright XP-55 Ascender. The XP-55 Ascender was a revolutionary design, featuring a pusher engine, canards, and a tricycle landing gear. While it looked futuristic, its performance was underwhelming, and its stall characteristics were dangerous. Despite efforts to improve the design, multiple crashes led to its cancellation. The Ascender was simply too ahead of its time for the technology of the 1940s. Please click the subscribe button if you're enjoying this video. It really helps the channel. Number 5. North American YF-93. A derivative of the F-86 Sabre, the YF-93 was designed as a long-range penetration fighter. It had impressive range and firepower but struggled with intake design issues at high angles of attack. Despite its sleek appearance, the YF-93's performance wasn't enough to secure production orders, especially with faster bombers like the B-47 entering service. Number 4. Heinrich Pursuit. The Heinrich Pursuit was a biplane designed during World War I, an era when the U.S. was eager to develop its own high-performance fighters. Despite a promising design, foreign aircraft were often preferred, and the pursuit never saw widespread production. Though it was a decent aircraft, it was ultimately relegated to a footnote in aviation history. Number 3. Grumman XF-10F Jaguar. The XF-10F Jaguar was Grumman's first attempt at a variable geometry aircraft, a precursor to the F-14 Tomcat. The swing-wing design was appealing for its versatility, but the Jaguar was plagued by issues in almost every aspect of its performance. After only 32 test flights, the project was mercifully cancelled, paving the way for better designs in the future. Number 2. Lockheed XF-90 The XF-90 was developed by Lockheed Skunk Works as a long-range penetration fighter. Despite its sleek design and being the first USAF jet with an afterburner, it struggled to outperform its competitors. The Skunk Works team, 
led by Willis Moore Hawkins, had greater successes in other projects, but the XF-90 remains a fascinating, if ultimately unsuccessful, attempt. Number 1. Volte P-66 Vanguard The Volte P-66 Vanguard, with its sleek radial engine design, promised great handling and performance. Initially ordered by Sweden, the aircraft was redirected to the USAAF and the RAF during World War II. However, the P-66 was disliked by the British and faced issues like fragility and a tendency to ground loop. Eventually, most of the P-66s were sent to China, where many were destroyed during transit or testing. Despite its potential, the P-66 never became the fighter it was meant to be. These 10 aircraft, though cancelled, offer a glimpse into the challenges and innovations of aviation history. Each of these designs reflects the ambition and creativity of their time, even if they didn't quite reach their full potential. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you in the next video.